Hi guys, welcome to JavaInterviewQuestions.com. This is Sandeep. Today we will see uh, write a program how to compare two strings in Java. So to compare two strings in Java, we have a method called compare to. We have a method called compare to, which accepts string and returns integer value. Which accepts string and returns integer value. So this compare to method what it does is it compares string and alphabetical order and returns ascii value difference it compares string in alphabetical order and returns difference as ascii values so in string class we have compare to method which returns so the possibilities of this compare to methods are we have three possibilities that means we can get three possible values one is zero and the other one is less than 0 and the other one is greater than 0. First one is 0. If both strings are equal as per alphabetical or dictionary order, then it returns value 0. If both strings are equal as per alphabetical order, dictionary order, then both strings returns 0. Then when you call compare to method, it returns 0. If string on which compare to method is called is less than the argument, if string on which compare to method is called is less than the argument, string on which compare to method is called is less than argument then it returns less than zero suppose apple dot compare to banana apple dot compare to banana so apple is less than banana right so in this case what happens is it returns less than zero so the possible value it returns is less than zero and next one is greater than zero a string on which compare to method is called is greater than argument. A string on which compare to method is called is greater than argument. Then it returns greater than zero. So first example here the example is orange dot compare to apple. So orange dot compare to apple. So orange is as per dictionary order it is greater and as per dictionary order apple is smaller. That means a value is 1, orange m, o value is 15. So, orange is greater than apple. So, in this case, it will return positive value. Let's see a program with help of an example to demonstrate compared to strings. Demo. So, I have taken a class called compare to strings demo and I have written a main method. I am taking three strings to demonstrate this program first string is string s1 equals to orange and the next string is string s2 equals to apple string s3 equals to banana So now what we will do is, we will compare each string with the other. So now what I am doing is, I am writing system.out.println. So first I am comparing s1 and s2. s1 dot compare to of s2. s1 dot compare to of s2. So if you take s1 and s2, what the output should be now? it should be positive that means greater than zero why because orange is greater than apple so that as per alphabetical order so as per alphabetical order o has the highest value and a has the least value so that when we say system dot out dot printl and s1 dot compare to s2 it should return positive value let's see the output Okay. You see the output, it returned for positive value. Now, what I am doing is I am comparing S3 dot compared to of 
test two. So s two dot compared to your s three. So s two is apple and s three is banana. So apple is less than banana. Why? Because a the ASCII value of A is less than ASCII value of B. So that is the reason it should print the value less than zero. In the same way, it compares each of the each and other value each and other character. Let's run the program and see the output. So now, if you see the output, it returned minus one. So this is how compare to method works. it compares the characters in a string lexicographically or alphabetically or in the dictionary order so we compare two strings by using compare to method and we call compare to method on one string and compare it with the other string this is how the string compare to method works thanks for watching this video if you like my video don't forget to subscribe to my videos